All right, so what was the amps here in this one line? 0.5? Yeah. What was the amps in this line? 0.5. Now when you clamped around both wires together, what'd you get? One. 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 Wow, look at that. Yes. So let's say that these were individual wires and this one went here. I'm sorry, let's put a let's put that terminal block here. This wire went here to that terminal block, and this wire went here to that terminal block. And then on the other side of that terminal block, there's just one wire coming forward. If I was to clamp that amp meter right here, if there was room, what do you think it would read? One. One, one amp splits and goes to the two individual loads. The speed of electron flow is a half an amp, a half an amp, but together they would be <laughs> one amp. So if I clamped on just this wire or I clamped on both of these wires together, it would still be one amp. Now what if I was to pull these wires together? So this wire and this wire here. So this wire came down like this and this wire came down like that, like a picture. And I was to clamp it around here, like this. What would I be reading? One, I think one. How many people say one? You the one that said it, you gotta at least raise your hand on yours. How many people say one? Okay, so one person says one. Okay, I heard point five. How many people say point five? Ooh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Thirteen. I know. I scared me, man. I don't know. All right. What was your choice? I don't know. Other? On the side. Other, yeah. Right in the middle. Yeah. <laughs> 14. What was your um, choice? One. One. Oh, you got a buddy. <laughs> All right. Uh, so two for one. Ah, two for one. Who else didn't vote? Did you vote? Yeah. Who else didn't vote? Wouldn't somebody else didn't vote? I think we're missing a person. I think we are too. So the real answer would be. You. Oh. <laughs> what? Here's why. This side is going to be a positive 0.5, and this side is going to be a negative 0.5. Oh. Now, one sixth of a second is going to reverse. This is going to be a positive, and then this is going to be negative. And then it's going to reverse. This will be positive, and then this will be negative. And it's going to reverse. This will be positive, and this is going to be negative. It's changing directions 60 times a second. So imagine a battery switching the terminals back and forth 60 times a second. Right, that's how often it's changing directions, right? Between positive and negative. So that means that if this is a positive 0.5 and this is a negative 0.5, and if I clamp around both, my positive magnetic field and a negative magnetic field is going to read what on my meter? So it cancel each other out, it will be zero. What? So I can clamp around more than one wire as long as it's on the same side. If I try to clamp it around both wires, on opposite sides, it'll cancel each other out. Does that make sense? Yeah, you're positive from up top and you're negative on bottom. So just this one, 0.5, just this one, 0.5, but once they go together, it would be Two. one. And how many, how many different loads could I add together? As, as many as I can get until I get to the breaker size, in which case we're going to have a trip breaker. Who will get to later? So that would suggest that if you kind of your ammeter around the inside of the first load and the outside of the second load it would still be zero. Ooh. Should we try it? it in theory, that would that would make sense. It's just a we could try it, yeah. I guess it's but before you try it, seven. it's good. I, lo I love how you're thinking, though. That's good. You're thinking about it. Just go right here. It's right there, right? So here's what we're gonna do next. I don't, I don't want to slow it is interesting. It's a good thought. I mean, he's questioning it. He's not questioning it, but you know. This time we're going to take line one. We're going to go into a switch. We're going to come out of the switch. We're going to go into a light bulb. We're going to come out of that light bulb and go home to the opposite side. Mm -hmm. But coming out, I'm also going to come out on that same switch and go to another light bulb and go home to the opposite side. Oh. Will that work? One switch controlling two different loads? I don't know. Let's try it and see. And then check amps.